Hey guys, what's up? I am fishing a small stream here in North Central Pennsylvania, a tributary to the Loyal Sock Creek. I am fishing with my buddy Michael. He is a worship leader at my uh, church, the Door Fellowship here in Williamsburg, Pennsylvania. We've gone to the same church almost our whole lives, so I've known him for a long time. First time I fished with him. Loves the outdoors, he does some archery hunting. Um, also has gotten into fly fishing, so really excited to be fishing with him. I think you'll really like the video, so stay tuned. It looked like a good fish too. It did look like a good fish. <laughs> I don't know how this guy got got my fly in his mouth. <laughs> Dude, oh, he wanted that stimulator hard. So the trick is going to be getting my fly in there. There's dead water here, a dead pocket behind that rock where there's not any current. Fast water close to me, and then the run I want to fish is faster water. So what I need to be able to do is get close enough without spooking any fish in there. And sometimes that's fish on this side that you may spook into the other pool. So how close can I get without spooking fish? 
and still be able to get my fly line close enough, my fly close enough to the target that I can get a good drift. And you see that rock, how it's just, just kind of touching the ground, but it has that gap. The fish will love hiding in there. They can get underneath that big rock and hide. We've got some depth, some flow, cover. Should be a fish in there. All right, so there was a fish in there, but I missed him, took my fly, set the hook, didn't get him. I'm actually gonna do a fly change. I'm gonna think I'm gonna go over to a beetle and then also a green weedy dropper. So we'll see if that uh, helps me out at all. Ooh. Are you kidding me? Bigger fish. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Fantastic. Wow, you got beautiful colors. Try to drop my line in. I know it's hard. It's undercut rock. Let's see if there's any trout hanging out that want the green weenie. Got one, dude. Nice one. I don't know. He's, he's oh, a fighter. It's not bad. Oh my gosh, yeah, dude. Really? Yeah, dude. Oh! Yeah, dude. Not expecting that. <laughs> the green weenie. Strikes again. Show you guys this fish. And then let them go. Got my hand wet, it's a little hard to reach the water from here. Wow. I actually think that you're not setting the hook hard enough. Is that what it is? I'm setting yeah. it too soft. Yeah. Give it a, like, not a super pull it out of the water, but that was a decent, that was that big fish that again. That was that big fish again. And you just kind of like slowly raise your rod tip and then yep. you had pressure on it, but I don't think the hook was like. Ooh. Right, it wasn't in him.
Yeah, just let it keep floating back there. There's a better one. guys that's gonna be a wrap thanks for watching we're gonna try the other side of this hole here if there's anything else make sure you hit the like button subscribe if you're not already and thanks for following along